Devil Tales. <laughs> Hello and salutations, friends. My name is Revel the Jester, and I'm here to share with you a multitude of fantastic stories. Competition is a normal part of life. But as with most things, too much of it can have serious consequences. Here is a tale about a snail and his egotistical brother. I call it Snailbird the Snow. See that snail yelling in the back and about to lose his shit? Uh, uh, Louis! What, what, what do you think you're doing? On our mother's grave? If you cross that line, I'm gonna disown you! Louis! Louis! That's my brother, Snailbert. I guess he's angry that I'm about to win this race. Ever since we were snail hatchlings, he always gloated about how fast he was. You know what I like about you, Louis? You may not be as fast as me, but you stay in your lane. Stick by me and I'll bring you places. To his credit, his speed was always impressive, but only in the wetlands. I met a city snail once years ago who happened to watch one of our swamp's annual relays. Snailbert participated of course, sporting his now iconic pimped out turtle shell, and won. But the city snail was not impressed. He turned to me and muttered, You kidding me? I know at least 50 snails who'd leave that guy in the dust. Most of these guys aren't even using slime drifting. Slime drifting? I asked. The city snail snickered and told me all about it. After that day, I practiced and practiced until I finally got it. And well, here we are. I'm inches away from crossing the finish line. And all Snailbird can do is scream and whine like a punk ass bitch. I guess he should have been improving his run skills instead of running his mouth. <laughs>